I'll tell you all about it. That was real good. That was like, that was money, first of all. Let's do another one. Okay. Hey everyone, this is The Real Review 3000 and I'm Chris Knight. If you can't tell by the graphics around me, we are talking Spider-Man Far From Home. This is going to be a reaction video to the trailer that was released not too long ago. There are spoilers in this trailer I've heard, so please do not watch this video if you have not seen Avengers Endgame. And seriously, if you haven't, get out there and watch it! Three, two, one. Reaction. The Spider-Man Far From Home trailer is about to play, but if you haven't seen Avengers Endgame yet, stop watching because there's some Listen to this guy right here. He knows what he's talking about. But if you have seen Avengers Endgame, enjoy the trailer. Everywhere I go, I see his face. I just really miss right him. from the get-go, it looks like. Yeah, I miss him too. Happy. I don't think Tony would have done what he did if he didn't know that you were going to be here after he was gone. There you go, they did. Just throw it out there. Ooh, yeah. You gonna be the next Iron Man now? Well, no, I don't have time. I'm too busy doing your jobs. Oh. I'm kidding, Ow. I'm kidding. Look, keep up the good work. Because I am going on vacation. Hmm. So I guess this has got to be like a senior got, trip or something like that. And it looks like... I don't like really want to talk to Nick. Have, like, it looks like Peter Parker's kind of him, adopted to or... Uh, inherited happy. I gotta go. You do not and... ghost Nick Fury. Wow. What's up? What's up? Oh, you don't We're just ghost him. about the trip. I'm here in St. Marco Polo's. Oh. oh, I think MJ <sighs> really likes me. That reminds me when I first fell in love. You're a very difficult uh -oh. person to contact, Spider-Man. <laughs> and that's why you don't ghost him right there. This is Mr. Beck. We could use someone like you on my world. Your world? Beck is from Earth, just not ours. The snap to our hole in our dimension. Uh, You're saying there's a multiverse? We have a job to do. So You're the snap with us. did mess up at least the fabric of the universe, but be possibly time too. What about Thor? Off world. Captain Marvel. Unavailable. <laughs> Looks like they're giving Look, some just the nods to the other superheroes. Bitch, please, you've been to space. <laughs> What do you want, Peter? I want to so is Mysterio girl like really a like good guy or a bad feel. guy in this? MJ, it's kind of a. I'm Spider Man. It's kind of no, vague. Of course I'm not. It's interesting. I mean, and it's hmm. kind of obvious. That's interesting. You may not be ready. But I wonder this if is my responsibility. I wonder if that's going to be something they cut out or not. Sacrifice. Sometimes people die. I'm not sure. MJ should know this early on that he is Spider Man, but we'll see. I always feel like I'm putting my friends in danger. The world needs the next Iron Man. I like Mysterio's outfit though. It looks really good. I, I think oh. what I'm seeing here, I like the uh, costumes. And it looks really good. I mean, so far, I mean, this is an amazing trailer. Gotta get the guys out of here. Get on the jet. Who are you? I work with Spider-Man. You work for Spider-Man? I work <laughs> with Spider-Man, not for Spider-Man. <laughs> uh oh. New plan. Yeah, new plan. Wow, that is, that's a trailer, guys. That is a trailer and a half. Um, yeah, oh, wow. Um, so, yeah, some good things in here. Uh, Mysterio's outfit, I love that. Uh, you know, it's definitely moving on from Endgame. So, that alone that it kind of picks up right there is very good so we know it's five years past the snap or so somewhere around there so we do know that peter parker has not aged in five years um so that's just interesting that they're going to continue that storyline but they are also throwing in a multiverse and possibly the time itself has been skewed in other parts and also that now that that we've established there's a multiverse there is that part in the uh, in Endgame that they mentioned that, that we could skew off. And uh, the Sorcerer Supreme even says it, that, you know, if, if you do this here, it's going to shoot us up here, and then we're going to be in a different spot, so there'll be two lines running. But, uh, so, they, so they're continuing on with this, which is interesting, and it almost seems to me like they're trying possibly to set up if this arc doesn't work towards Phase 4 and stuff, that they can kind of snap everything back, Unfortunately, like a uh, 
Days of Future Past that X Men tried. Um, but I mean, this makes me happy to see that they're that at least it's a strong movie to jump to Phase Four, and a lot of people, even myself included, are somewhat skeptical skeptical of Phase Four and what it will bring. But if you're like me, you're going to give it a shot probably movie to movie and as long as they don't go and just totally destroy what the mcu is then there's a good chance that um phase four will turn out okay with that said that's my reaction guys um i don't know about you july 2nd right there it says it um i'd love to go see this movie and uh, I, I plan on doing that and giving you one of our honest uh reviews of it and with that said i'm chris knight this is the real review 3000 do me a favor like and subscribe please like this video subscribe to the channel we're trying to get up to um a thousand subscribers we're also raising money for saint jude children's research hospital check out the subscribers for a cause video for more about that we plan on having a live stream coming up also soon with somebody from saint jude children's research hospital to explain more about what we're trying to do and what they try to do thank you very much for watching this and have a nice day